Today we're going to return to the filter we've created last week and we're going to bring it to the next level. So last week we've created a randomized filter. The point was actually figuring out what your TikTok dance is. And in today's video we are going to learn how to let each different value trigger a different sound. Okay, so we are going to start building from... Um, actually we're going to get the next patch from equals and we're going to add a patch which is called not and after that we're going to add a patch called equals exactly rooting from floor after that we're going to add a patch called and and we're going to connect equals exactly as well. After that, we're going to add a pulse patch and to the turn on section, we're going to add single clip controller. And after that, we're going to add a audio player and Okay, and here we're going to add a speaker on this side and we're going to add the actual song which should play here. Now I'm going to show you how, let me just delete this. So how you add the song, how you can add the song, you click on add asset and you import it from the computer. Oh, this is two times. All right, here we go. Right, candy, we're skipping, no, doesn't matter. And for the speaker, no, this is what we do. So in fact, to actually figure out which image is corresponding, which value on top of this guy's head, we have to, you can actually go back to your random, uh, random node flow. Uh, what is it? The random patches. And you go to the random patch and then you can actually define which picture you're going to see. And this way you can actually figure out which dance is which picture. So in this case, we're going to check uh, what value the second picture should be. It says Renegade, but in fact, I know that's not true. No idea, that's right. The second is the no idea. So in this case, we're going to, for the equals exactly, we're going to fill in two. So it's going to correspond with the second picture and that was the no idea. So we're going to drag in the song no idea and we're going to connect it to the audio only. And then for the outlet, we're going to have to add a speaker. This is going to trigger the speaker. And sorry, no, we're going to come over here and then you click on audio on this yellow arrow. It's going to create the patch and then you're going to connect it to the audio part. And if everything is true, okay, so it equals to the second picture, then we're going to change the random here. Well, no, we're just going to leave it here. And then we're going to play. And if everything is true, then it should actually play the no idea song. Now. Here we go but <laughs> it goes a little bit too quick so i'm not sure why you click on it it pulls out no idea and then it plays the song that's right now we have another six song to add so in my case or in your case as well the only thing you basically have to do is that you select all these nodes and then you comment c and comment v them so you copy and paste and in this case, the only thing we have to change is going to be cutting the chord between the audio player and no idea song, since we have another song now to add. And right, we have to create another speaker then. For each song, you have to create a separate speaker. And the next one is going to be, um, let me just see, Renegade. So again, I know because I checked all the values and I know that the third uh, picture is actually Renegade. So I'm going to change the equals exactly to three. So when the third picture pops up, it's going to play Renegade. 
Now I'm going to drag in Renegade from here and I'm going to connect it to the audio clip. As, as I said, we have to add the second speaker. We click here on the right arrow, it creates the node, we connect it and here we go. All right, and it triggers the new idea, so that's fine. The only thing I want to add is that these files, these M4A files, are quite huge. So in the end, you will have to be aware that the max size of filter you can upload to Facebook is going to be a maximum of 10 megabytes. So anything larger than that will not get accepted and will not go through the prior screen, to the very first screening. Um, so please be aware of this. And uh, I hope you enjoyed this tutorial and yeah, just give it a like and subscribe if you wish. And then I'll see you the next time. Goodbye.